welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is a travesty coming back at you with some Neverwinter Nights 2 using the Baldur's Gate Reloaded mod. This video is a spoiler video. This video will show you how to find some hidden items in the game. If you do not wish to know anything about these hidden items, then stop watching this video now because this is a spoiler video. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to find the three early hidden items. The three items being the diamond, the ring of protection, and the ring of wizardry. Now the hidden items are actually brought back into the game once you have patch 1 installed on the game, bringing your version to 1.1. Now even with the patch, just so you know, there are still some bugs with the ring of protection and the ring of wizardry you will not be able to find those items. So in the meantime, we're going to show you how to find the first item, which is the diamond. Now we are actually in the coastway, and I'll show you here on the map. We are on the eastern side near the transition point. The diamond is actually in this location right here behind Benkos and at the base of this tree. This is the easternmost transition. And the trigger box to actually find it is about the size of this green box that I'm making for you right now. It's a pretty large box that'll trigger the opportunity to find that hidden item. Now something of note is the DC to find this hidden item is 15 and that DC check is made on a D12 so if you do the math you have to have at least a three in search to have any chance of finding this hidden item but since you have Emily in the group yep. you should be okay or even for that fact Monteron because both of these characters a clear, have a seven skill in search so you should be okay as long as you have Emily or Monteron in the party if your main character does not have a high enough search skill now in order to find this you have to be in search mode or your character has to be an elf who is always in search mode so what we're gonna do I do have Emowyn and Montron both in the party so we're gonna have both of them go into search mode okay now that we have Emowyn and Montron in search mode we're gonna start making our way up toward this area right here and hopefully we can trigger this hidden item And as we're walking up here, make sure you keep an eye on this message window. Once you see something, there it goes. See, it says you found something of interest. That means you just triggered it. Now, sometimes it might take a little longer, so just be patient with that. If you have to, like, walk outside of the box and walk inside the box. Or sit there and wait for a while and see if it'll come up. But anyways, what we're looking for is this message down here. You found something of interest. Now, something I hope the BGR team implements is maybe a little message pop up over the character saying, hey, you found something, or even the voice act, you know, actors play something like, oh, looky here, or something like that. It'll, it'll tip you off to if you found something that was hitting. Because if you're not paying attention to this, you could easily just, it could just go right by you. You wouldn't even notice it if you weren't looking at the message window. Okay, so anyways, now that we've got this message, you've found something of interest. If you hit the Z key, you should be able to highlight the hidden item that is now revealed to us which is right here you'll see a little mound of dirt right here and it's got a question mark on it once you mouse over it so let's go take a look at that and there's your diamond we're gonna take that now that diamond can be sold around for 560 gold I believe it was depending on your uh, appraise skill of course so that's the gist of how to find the diamond now we're gonna go see if we can find the ring of protection okay now for the second of the three hidden items that I'm going to show you which is the ring of protection brings us to Lion's Way and I'll pull up the map we are over here on the west side of the map and this is where you first come in the map when you first start playing the game uh, the secret item is pretty much due north of where you enter right here so looking here Here's where you come in on the map. Here's a map transition. If you look straight north right here, you're going to see this kind of like a canyon right here. And you'll see these two big boulders. Right in between them right here is where the ring of protection is going to be. And something you need to know is as of patch 1, 
this hidden item is still broke. You will not be able to find it. However, I know the fix for it already, and I already have implemented it, and this one will work for me. Um, but that's another story. I might make another vid on how I did that, but I want to show everybody where these are. So when a patch does come out, a patch 2 or a hot fix by the BGR team, you guys at least have an idea of where this ring of protection actually is. Um, there's a trigger box, and the trigger box is roughly about this size right here so if you enter that box and on heartbeat you should be able to find it as long as you have search mode turned on so let's go test it out <laughs> and I still have M1 and Monter on here they both ha have the same uh, search DC uh, search skill of seven so we're gonna put them in search mode yep. or like I said if you have an elf in the group you can use elf too as long as their uh, search skill is at least three or higher so let's take a mosey on over here and see if we can activate this trigger to find this ring of protection. Now, once again, pay close attention to the message area here. You're probably going to see a message like, there it is. It just, it just triggered. You found something of interest. Now, if you look closely, once you get that message pop up, again, hit the Z key. Look over here by these two big boulders, and right here, you'll see it. It's another little pile of dirt with... We're going to access that, and there's the ring, it's unidentified, give it to somebody with a high lore skill who can look at it, and there you go. Ring of protection plus one gives you plus one deflection and a plus one universal saving throws. So let's equip it to make sure it works. I have currently have an armor class of 12, my fortitude, reflex, and will is 240 respectively. Let's go ahead and equip that, and yes it's working. My armor class is now 13, and my saves are now 3, 5, and 1. So the ring works, good to go. Okay, and on to the third and final one that I'm going to show. There's other, there's other hidden items in the game, but I just want to highlight these first three because they're probably the most important ones in the, in the early game. Now we're going to go to the Friendly Arm Inn and get the Ring of Wizardry. And here we are at the Friendly Arm Inn, and we're about ready to go find the next hidden item the ring of wizardry now let me pull up the map so I can show you where everything's at here we're down here in the south side of the map at the transition point right here and the area where the ring of wizardry is at is right over here to directly to the east of where we currently are now so as soon as you come on the map you can just pretty much head this way and the area we're gonna be dealing with is this small set of rocks right here in between all these trees this is where the Ring of Wizardry is going to pop up, right in, right in here, just south of this small pile of rocks. Now, the trigger area is quite big for this one, too. It's, uh, let's see, it's actually, yeah, it's probably about like that, something like that. It's a pretty good size, so, yes, yeah, about that area right there. That's plenty size for a trigger. So, we're going to do what we did last time, have Monter on, go search mode and M1 go search mode and let's go take a mosey over here and see if we can discover this ring of wizardry again keep an eye on your uh, message panel down here let's see if you can trigger it And there it goes, it just activated. You found something of interest. So if you hit the Z key, and there you go, you can highlight it now. Small pile of dirt right there. So open that container up, and there's our ring. It's also unidentified. So I think what we'll do, let's go to the chapel real quick and get it identified, and we can show you everybody what's going on with us. Okay, so we just got the ring identified in the chapel. I just wanted to show you guys what this thing actually does. It does give you three slots in either Bard, Sorcerer, or Wizard uh, level one spells. So, And let's test it out. Let's equip it real quick. Let's take a look at our spell book. And there we go. It gave me three extra slots, so it is working ring. So, okay, so that's it. That's the first three uh, hidden items. The diamond, the ring plus one, and the ring of wizardry. And just to reiterate, like I said, the as of patch one 
the Ring of Protection and the Ring of Wizardry are still bugged. You will not be able to find them. They are there, but you just won't be able to find them. Uh, I'm, I'm quite certain the BGR team is working diligently to get a hot fix or another patch or anything to get that squared away. But uh, I just wanted to show you guys where these items were. So when that patch is released, you guys can enjoy those hidden items. Uh, I was actually thinking about making a video on how to make the fixes before the patch is released. So I know there's a lot of people out there that want to hurry up and play this game and they want to get access to those hidden items. Um, but I'm reluctant to make a video on how to get into the tool set and make those fixes because there's a potential where other things could get screwed up and I don't want to be the person who caused that because <laughs> if, if somebody screws something up and then they end up going to the, the BGR forums or something and say hey there's more bugs and come to find out those bugs weren't actually there they were actually caused by the person that was messing around in the tool set then I could potentially be to blame and I don't want to do that to the BGR team but uh, maybe on a case by case basis I, I can make a, a, a short video or something on how to make the fixes in the tool set to get those rings fixed for you but knowing me as soon as I get that damn video published there's gonna be a hot fix out anyway so uh, I'll probably not make a video but we'll see alright guys I hope you guys have fun and look forward to the next patch or the hot fix coming out from the BGR team and then you can get access to those hidden items have a good one this is a travesty signing off <laughs>